What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into Race Away B Girl out on a date with Jazz. Pretty boy Fredo beefing with another YouTuber child. Why? Let's get it. So Jazz and Amar was caught by a fan who recorded them on a date. Now, Amar six days ago just posted up a video saying how he was going to try to work it out with his girlfriend. And supposedly, according to her, because she was just on TikTok Live yesterday crying, saying that they broke up again. And according to the fan, because she recorded them, he's already out and about with his ex. You see Amar bring the girl he cheated on. Yo, why the fuck is that Amar and Jazz? Why the fuck Amar got a whole different bitch here he got a whole different bitch here the same place that he, the same place that he brought the ex to bro damn well he's single he can do what he want that he broke up with the girl right there is a my girl and then jazz is with the girl right there what the fuck like this is so messy bro <laughs> So people feel it's like messy. He, her ass recording it. <laughs> playing in her face. Also in that same video, Jazz was out with Ray's ex. Now the reason why supporters are upset is because during a recent smash or pass, Ray said that she passed on Crystal because she didn't want to disrespect Jazz. Y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all think when it comes to that. Now there has been rumors about Ty Taylor being pregnant after this picture was posted, but Ty Taylor responded. Cause we back heavy in the gym with it. Sure. <laughs> y'all see him coming in. You thought I was gonna be in the house with you. Psych. The girl that got put on blast by Kaisenet, she speaks out and tell how her and Kaisenet met for the first time. Yeah, I know she ain't got no platform no more because her Instagram was deleted. So we had we had actually got uh we had met on a live stream on his um Twitch. My homeboy had a Twitch. We got on the Twitch. He like did some shit to make him recognize that he was on that shit or whatever. And I got on there, I spit my game or whatever. He like, oh, give me your number, you don't know, slide on me or whatever. I'm like, okay, I gave my number. He like, damn, you left me on red for two years. Shit, I don't even remember the, I don't remember the- Two years I is guess crazy. I left him on red for two years. He probably was a nobody back then, so I was just like, whatever. And <laughs> I left him on red, but I'm like, shit, fuck it, I'll make it up to you. So he sent me a black car. I left my car where I was at, and he sent me a black car, and- Went to the crib. For the past year, Pretty Boy Fredo and Devon J have been hanging out and filming. But recently they got into it and now they're beefing. I don't associate myself with nobody, no, no man, no nothing. I'm not going to do it now. I got here by myself. None of that shit. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? They want to use me when they when they falling off and shit. One try to throw me in the group. I ain't in your motherfucking group. Suck my Damn. Shut out the end. Doing shit. The fuck is you talking about? Did some nut shit, right? I had the whole group calling my motherfucking phone. I had all them calling my shit. They were supposed to do a video shoot Friday. I shut that shit down. I said, I ain't doing shit. You know what I'm saying? Y'all niggas checking with me. I'm moving like this is my city. And I'm from Philly and I'm acting like this is my city. I said, y'all ain't checking with me. Try to use my cameraman and shit, but ain't say shit to me. I said, stupid. I shut that whole video shoot down. I made the go home. Y'all can ask the right now. Ask anybody in SSH. I said, I made all them fuck home i said y'all not doing it one bit y'all not doing no vids out here without mom fuck <laughs> listen i said y'all not doing the vid out this my permission i'm scared as fuck they canceled the vid all that shit i ain't playing with these bro imagine calling apologizing just so they can do their video shoot <laughs> believe it or not y'all think i'm gonna get on here and lie pretty boy fredo you can't get another cameraman <laughs> What is this? <laughs> Chill, everybody's calling me saying you're on their ass, calling me saying they can't do anything. Chill. I said, bro, fuck you, nigga. Oh, fuck if you manage me and them, nigga. I'll fuck up everybody's money. I don't give a fuck. Boy, he is really upset, ain't it? That was a bit much. Okay. Um. So let's see what, um, what you call it, talking about uh, Maya. So now as many of you guys know, Amar and Maya <coughs> have called it quits. Now they've been back and forth off and on for quite some time now, but Maya has been very emotional because she's stating this time it seems like Amar is completely done with her. She was on TikTok and she was basically in tears. Mm. The last message I sent when I, when I, when I was done. No, I'm saying when was the last time you talked to him? 
the last message when I had sent and I said I was done and like when was it? When was that? Mm. Like the eleventh or something like that. That was the Who's eleventh. That? Mm -hmm. okay. So do do y'all always do y'all break up and go days that I talk to each other and get back together? It just be me like like I I just like he'll just blow up my phone and stuff. Like don't leave, don't leave and stuff. But this time like it's a good thing. So do so Men are starting to sound about right when they say if you cheat if if your man cheat on you, like where you going? Because she was literally like, I'm out. But I guess expecting him to blow her up this time and he didn't. And now she like, oh, no. That's crazy. Like, do he be reaching out? Oh, she had to mute it. He did cry for you too. <laughs> Not on here upset for real though. Yeah. Okay, so like, okay. I feel like I can be a little transparent here. Been that young nigga fucking loud and stuff, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I be talking about people that be crying on camera and stuff. You should do that. So I just can't turn. Well, I'm not gonna say I don't talk. I, I ain't gonna say I talk about people, but like, I just don't understand why people do it. Because niggas be emotional. <laughs> I used to do the same thing until I started crying on camera, too. You know, play as fuck up. But. Yeah, I'm not okay. This is, this is, yeah. I'm I'm smiling and I'm laughing, but it's just like, yeah, I'm, I'm smiling, I'm laughing, but it's just like, nothing is funny. Nothing is smileable, but it's just like you just have to laugh to keep from crying. Literally, I'm in confusion. Like. You know, she she said that she ain't want to be with him no more. You know what I'm saying? So it's given he just went with it, and now it's like, nah, I was just playing. It's like killing is it's so ugly because it's just like why do I have to go through this like I can't even I can't even go a day with just I don't know huh I don't know I'm not gonna cry on here and I'm just but I just feel like it's just not fair what's well, not fair It's not fair to like people can just go on with their life just knowing that you just knowing <laughs> that they broke your heart. Yeah, they do. Okay, Jess, she got everything going on in the background. It's pretty clear her heart is broken. <clears throat> And it's pretty clear that Amar has moved on. <sighs> y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, yeah.